All right, thanks so much, Frankie. It's cold outside, but this dude's been heating up the court. He has been rated by many as the number one prospect in the class of 2023. He's just 16 years old. It's Elijah Fisher from here in Toronto. He's capturing the attention of Canadians, but our neighbors to the south as well. He's joining us with his dad, Rowan. Good morning, Ro. Good morning, E. How you guys doing? We're good. How are you doing? I'm doing morning, well. I'm doing thanks. Well. Uh, Elijah, right away, man, you're hearing that. The, the pressure is on. How are you maintaining when you hear things like, yo, top of his class, this guy is going to be potentially going number one in the draft? How do you handle that, and how do you feel hearing that? Well, the way I handle all uh, the pressure is the grace of God. I pray every day, and family keeps me connected in one to let me know that I'm just a regular person. It is. And I know, man, I see your social media. I know you like to have fun. You get out there, you wild out a little bit. Dad, how do you keep him, you know, focused and, and keep him level with all of it? You know, Elijah's uh, one of um, five boys, and we treat him just as, as he is. He's, a, he's, he's my son. And, you know, the regular chores at home. And if he does wrong, we punish him the same way. Inside the house, he's, he's my son. Outside, he might be um, a star to everybody else, but to me, he's my son. I've got to raise him as such. It's it. Elijah, your shooting guard. Who is it in the NBA that you look at to try and model your game off of? A lot of Kevin Durant. I like the way that he plays, the way he's able to score the ball. A lot of LeBron James because of the way how he controls the floor, able to guide his team and play as captain. Now, Elijah, I don't know if you, you know, heard. Of, I played some, some ball over at Crestwood. You know where you're at. I don't know if you heard the legend. You know, eight three pointers in one game. I just want to see how you compare. How you compare if you got that kind of skill? What's your What's your career high so far? Well, my career high, I would say, is around career high for threes. I say it's around eight or nine. Okay. Okay. Just said, you know, I'm trying to compare it. I only got 27 that game because I got fouled one on one of those threes. Uh, look, <laughs> <laughs> when you aren't training, what is it you enjoy most to do? Maybe it's with your brothers or with some of your, your friends. What is it? Well, training, what I do, well, what I do most is just spending time with, with family, people that actually have family, like my, my younger brother, Daniel, my brother, Jordan, Isaiah, or Ma, Jai, just all of us as one, just laughing and having fun. And right now, with the pandemic, this is for both of you. Either one of you can answer this. With the pandemic and, of course, over the last 12 months, it's been very different. You can't get into a lot of gyms and things like that. What has training been like for you physically? Well, training for me physically has been very different because I'm used to always being in the gym, go, 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 and I have to find different ways how to work out, do some workouts at home in my basement, do some workouts in the front or in the backyard when I can. Mm -hmm. And if there's gyms open, I can find a gym, and I'm able to get in. And, and then the mental aspect of that, you know, not being able to, to put up the shots and, and to get in there, how have you been handling that? At first, it was very hard for me because I'm seeing everyone in America playing basketball. But then I just sat down and prayed and just know that God has something for me. Look, Ro, you know, the, the, the family is strong. We, we got the skill set from Elijah. We're looking forward to it. What is one thing you want everyone to know about your son? Uh, he's very humble kid and um, he's driven very focused to the goal that he um, wants to achieve and he's going to put his all into um, achieving his goals. We cannot wait to see where you go next when it's the college circuit and then to the NBA. We are going to watch your story and follow you along. You guys are welcome back on the show anytime. Ro, E, thank you guys for joining us this morning and good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, we'll talk to you. And we'll have a three-point contest real soon, too. we got to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Steph, we'll send things up to you, see how the roads are looking. And I